Hi, uh, this is just a very little quick uh, tutorial that shows how to transform a uh, root motion animation moving forward like so into a uh, in place animation using Cascador. So we'll start uh, with a uh, uh, forward moving animation that I imported uh, from Unreal and uh, uh, we will go into the point controller mode. Uh, first thing we will do is to select a point that will like uh, uh, have the same that should have the same location in the first and the end frame of the uh, of the in place animation for example this uh, this uh, tip of the of the foot and uh, we will use that to track the, the looping and we will uh, lock it here so the trajectory, and when we choose something else, will be locked. So I always show this location. And uh, now we choose the entire interval, entire animation. And uh, uh, we go into the interval edit mode and we uncheck the fixed interpolation on change we only want to uh, change the keys next thing uh, we will go into scene settings interval edit mode uh, change curve parameter to linear next we will take uh, the we will take the first frame and we'll mark it with a little flag here. So it, what it does, we will see here. We don't see here very much because it's hidden by other points, but it draws it's a little red circle. We'll need that later. Now we will choose the entire interval we will choose the center of mass the blue point here and uh, we will move uh, the center of mass uh, back like so but to see better what we are doing we will instead of moving directly uh, the center of mass we'll right click on the tip of the feet foot and place our pivot here and be sure you are in global mode not in local mode so now we will drag this point and you see our our trajectory is like a collapsing and here you can see very well now the the first frame the first key it's red so our goal now is just align the last frame with the first frame. That's why we we highlighted it in red. Here I will zoom a little bit more and I will overlap the red and the blue points. And I press control to to move uh, not much slightly okay and now to control I zoom back I can switch between first and last frame and you see the pose doesn't change now I can remove this remove this remove this et voila that's now the end result you can see she's running in place.
Thank you very much and goodbye.